Am I the asshole? For audibly saying bruh. When my sister announced she was pregnant again. Hello I'm F16 a younger sister to Lori. Me and Lori have never been close since we had different dads. I was an affair baby. She's always resented me for ruining her family but whatever. Lori has six kids. Yes. Six. Twin boys Beck and Joe who are seven, planned. A girl Liliana who's six unplanned. Another girl, Angel who's five, planned. Another boy, Keith who's two planned. And another baby boy Carl who's nine months not planned. Despite the fact that Lori is incapable of taking care of these kids, four of them were actually planned. Because she knows my pushover mom will give her money and watch the kids. My mom even quit her job to do so, even turning her workroom into a nursery for Carl. We're pretty well off, but we can't do this forever. I try not to judge, and just ignore Lori like she does me. Even though when my mom is busy doing something like changing a diaper I have to step in and help. Especially with the twins since they're very rough with each other. Tonight at dinner Lori's boyfriend joined a father to just Carl as well as Lori's father. This wasn't abnormal so I didn't think anything of it, until my sister said she had some exciting news. I wished she'd say something else. But I knew what she was going to say. I'm pregnant. She would say. Everyone went dead silent until I said bruh. I didn't mean to say it out loud, but come on. Lori gave me a death stare, and said if I wanted to say something I should just say it. So I did. Lori this is your. I take a moment to count sixth child. You know we can't keep supporting you. Without mom you'd be on the streets, and you know that. Look at mom, she's so tired she's always taking care of your kids and so am I. I'd bet I've changed more diapers than you have you selfish bitch. She began to cry. And ran out into her boyfriend's car, he followers her and drove. My mother then began to cry. She left to go out Carl back to bed since he woke up. It was just me and Laurie's father. He began to yell and told me a I was a brat and Laurie was a great mother, then he stormed off. As I am sitting here in the morning watching the boys, I'm thinking, was I too obnoxious? My mom says that a lot, I don't mean to be because of my autism but come on. Please give me some feedback, Reddit, am I the asshole? The dramatics in this post, smiley face, smiley face, smiley face smiley face. I take a moment to count. Smiley face, smiley face, smiley face. Not the asshole, smiley face, sorry I'm a mother to a 17f and 15f and bro is a common saying in my household. Good on you for calling her out and sticking up for your mother. It's not fair to these kids or your mother. If Lori's dad thinks she's such a great mother then perhaps he should quit his job and be the stay-at-home granddad. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. If it were me, I completely stop helping watch kids, but I can't stand when people pawn their kids off on family members. It really pisses me off since it happened to me as a kid. My parents decided to have more kids when I was 10, 14 and then again when I was 17. Guess when I moved out? at 17. I can't give credit, because it was from a random reddit comment, but to Ms. Quota wise random redditor it's a uterus, not a clown car. Not the asshole. You were blunt for sure, but at some point, shit needs to be said. She can't take care of her already present children, bringing more of them in the world is completely insane, both for her, for your mom, for you who end up eeping way too much for a 16 years old and most importantly, for those kids. Crying face, crying face, crying face. Not the asshole. If she can't take care of the kids she has then she doesn't need to be having more. I'd be aggravated if I was expected to take care of her kids as well. Bruh, you're definitely not the asshole here. 
Your sister needs to learn how to use birth control or at least take care of her own damn kids. And your mom needs to stop enabling her lazy ass. Not the asshole for sure. Not the asshole. Do you have an exit plan for when you turn 18? You're already having childcare pushed on you, it will get worse once you finish school. Can you get a part-time job and or start spending a lot of your time at a friend or friends? Make yourself scarce to minimize being forced to babysit, maybe that will force your mom to make your sister more involved or push her to force your sister to find other sitters. Six kids is too many. Natar and stop taking care of her kids. Get a job and start saving so you can get out ASAP. You know you'll get zero dollars for any higher education it's all going to the baby factory. Not the asshole at all. In my very own opinion, I think six children is fucking ludicrous and painfully unnecessary given the world is already quite overpopulated. Also, your sister doesn't even appear to have custody of all these children? Why was Carl at your house and his mother and father both took off so easily? They don't seem like the best parents, even if it was socially acceptable to have so many cattle. Your sister sounds like she loves being pregnant, and all the she gets with it, but doesn't really want to be a mom. Not the asshole. One day she will know the joy of being no contact with the children she pawned off on your mom. Info. Lori this is your. I take a moment to count sixth child. Isn't it her seventh child? So her youngest Carl doesn't even live with her? Why does she want a baby if she's not even taking care of the baby she already has? Not the asshole. If your sister wants to keep having babies, you can't stop her. If your mom wants to keep supporting her, you can't stop her. All you can control is your words and actions. If you don't wish to support your sister, bow out of those responsibilities. Not the asshole she clearly is selfish. She gets her feelings hurt and proceeds to leave her children to go home and cry about it with her boyfriend. Real moms don't get breaks like that you pack those seven kids around with you. For events, work, date nights I understand needing a sitter but to just go about life half-assing parenting is a joke. I would have brewed her too. Not the asshole. Bra should be the least of her worries. People who can't support their kids without so much external help should not have more kids. Your sis has already taken your mom and you for granted. They left you with the kids the morning after? I mean, I think that kinda proves your point here. Where TF was your sister? You are a little bit TA for how when you said it but you're also a teenager and your sister is supposed to be an adult with a fully developed brain. So I'm a rule not the asshole. It absolutely wasn't your place to say anything but clearly no one else in your family was going to. You definitely need to save up and move out. Those kids are not your problem. Not the asshole and please tell me Joe and Beck are not the twins real names. Not the asshole. People need to stop having kids when they can't won't take care of the ones they already have. Not the asshole. Some people need a serious splash of cold water to wake up and see the situation for what it really is.